dude, the following is non-profit fan-based Let's Play, dude. This guy belongs to NIS and NIS America, dude. Please support the official release, dude. Dude. Hello, my vassals, and welcome to the Eternal Flames. My name's DH Plays, and in case you missed the disclaimer, this property belongs to Nippon Ichi Software Inc. and NIS America. All the rights are reserved by them. On the other hand, they have allowed us to do this so long as we don't monetize. And if this wasn't a game that I already thoroughly enjoyed to hell and back, I wouldn't do it. I'm not even gonna lie, I wouldn't do it. I'd probably play it on my own, have fun, and if someone wanted to watch me on Steam, or yeah, on Steam, so be it. In the meantime, in between time, let's enjoy some story. And keep in mind, we will only be doing storyline missions and side missions, but none of the grind on this channel. If you want to see that, go to our Twitch on Wednesdays and Saturdays, and lately it seems like every other day, but uh, mostly Wednesdays and Saturdays. Let's get started. King Kridrevskoy, the mighty ruler of the Netherworld. His long reign came to an abrupt end as the news of his death spread throughout the Dark Land. Ambitious demons rose one after another to seize the opportunity. And thus began the age of turbulence and anarchy. Two years later... Prince! Prince, wake up! just won't wake up. Well, if that's the case, there's only one thing left to do. What fool dares awaken me, the great Laharl? Oh, Prince, I'm glad you're still alive. Who said I was dead? I was just taking a nap. Anyways, why are all those weapons behind you? Well, I was having a hard time waking you up. Are you sure you weren't trying to kill me instead? No! Uh, I mean, yes. I, I just wanted to wake you up. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. So, what is it? You better have a good reason for waking me up. Oh, yeah. Big news! Your father, King Krzyzewski, has died! He what? When? Two years ago. Wait a second. So, you're telling me that I've been sleeping for over two years? Yup. Yup? Why didn't you wake me up earlier? Excuse me, but what do you think I've been doing all this time? The Netherworld has gone to hell while you were sleeping. It's not my fault if some other demon steals the title of Overlord. What? Have they forgotten whose title they're trying to steal? <laughs> How bold of them. I shall show no mercy, for I am Laharl, the rightful heir to the throne. <laughs> Your humble vassal Etna will accompany you. Episode 1 Prince of the Netherworld. Okay. So, just fair warning if you haven't already seen this guy before. It kind of starts off like a cheesy anime, so uh, that's that's an actual thing. So if you don't much care for that, you you've already come to the wrong place. Hate to tell you that. Yeah, I'm also unlocking a secret right now, which you can only get by doing a certain way. Um, I think I have to actually press the other button first. So, fair warning, I'm going to skip tutorials. I'm not going to sit by and I'm not going to do the tutorials and waste your guys' time. 
Because, I'm not gonna lie, that's exactly what it is. It's a waste of time. I, I, I'm just gonna be honest. I tried to do the tutorials during my stream. I couldn't even do it then. I, I just... Prince, I'm uh, going to the bathroom, okay? I'm just not doing it. On the other hand, I will read these for you. This is my secret chamber. Only I know how to get in here. This is where my most precious memories were locked away. That I remember, but I can't remember what they were. When I try to remember, my heart aches. This pain is proof of how dear those memories are to me. I have to get them back. Also, for fair warning, if you want a character, please leave something in the comments. Feel free to request weapons in class. Just keep in mind that certain classes are better with certain weapons. We'll go over that another time. Skip, 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 skip. God, yeah, you can get weapons here. Your mastery rank will go up as you buy shit. You could also do stuff through the Dark Council and blah, 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 blah. Yeah, we know. Yeah, you sell other items like armor and, you know, yeah. They actually separate the armor uh, stuff and the um, consumables into two shops in the next game. So that's a, that's a thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know how to save. Stop it! Save. 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 If you notice, uh, the live stream's gotten pretty lively. Okay. I just want to make sure I saved in the right spot. Okay, yeah. Sweet. I do not want to overwrite my other data. I will cry. Okay, skip story only because I don't want to do the tutorial. Uh, basically, we have the printing squad, which are these assholes right here. So, I'm only skipping the story of story for the tutorial. The rest, you know, if you guys want to cry about, fine. But the tutorial is my call. Suck it up, sunshine. Your overlord has spoken. I want to make sure this fucker's dead if you can't tell. Here I come. Oh. Well. That went much smoother than I remember. Item. I'll do the next one. Oh, jeez, I thought I skipped it. No, no, no. Can I? Ah. Oh. Damn it. I tried. I. Uh. I hit the wrong button. <laughs> blah blah blah. I still don't understand why certain monsters can't. You'd think the uh the snow golems would actually be able to. Okay, I think we just want to power up Laharl a bit, so we're gonna go ahead and do Laharl. We're gonna attempt to get the good ending on this. Okay, level up. 
Let's go here and let's tack. And we'll just have Etna come over here and we'll have the Prinnies help her out. Because she is a slightly weaker character. And bada bing, bada bing, bada boom. Hmm. That would that would did it, but guess not. And the praise will draw attention anyways. Okay. Prinny attack you, Prinny attack you, Etna attacks you, and Laharl comes all the way over here to do nothing, I guess. Because I'm willing to almost bet money that, uh... Yeah, that's gonna be done by Etna. Boom, boom, boom! Once you and my let's spend the night together. Okay. Oh no, they hit up Bernie. No one cares. And that stage is done. We got a free staff. Skip story. Yes. Jeez. Okay. can I say, baby? I don't just have multiple good jokes. I don't just have multiple good colors. But I'm enlightening. Not the best setup, not the worst. Ooh, Muscle Brawn. Yes, Dark Assembly. Stop it! Blah, 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 blah. So, let me kind of explain how Mono works. For those of you who have not played this guy before, for each enemy we kill, we get mana. If you notice, Laharl has four mana. The way mana works is the enemies we kill, based on their levels, we will get mana, unless we have a special thing in place that allows us to get more mana. So, just an FYI for those who might be interested in picking up the game. Obviously, the printies haven't really killed much, so only this guy has really even got a mana. Yes, 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 yes. Heal my people. There we go. And someone just gave us some free money. So, can we do item world yet? I think we can, but I'm not sure. Yep. So, item world, for those who are also interested, allows us to go on an item and basically level it up. Once we enter, we cannot enter unless we have a Mr. Jensi. And even then, if we have a Mr. Jensi, we get out. But if we want to say go back in, we go back in at the level we left off at. Common items have 30 levels, rare items have 60, and legendary have 100. As the level or as the item levels up, it'll get more powerful. So just so you guys know, stuff that probably won't ever be seen on camera. Just, just saying. Okay, we want to make a character, create a new character. We want to make him, he's going to be a good for nothing slacker, so he's going to lose some points, and he's going to be named 
D H plays. I meant to do that a bit better, but me. D H. For the record, I am using a controller even though I'm on the PC version. It just feels natural to me. So, uh, suck it up, sunshine. And there we go. Minus five points. Uh, he does not need intellect at all. He could be the dumbest schmuck on the planet and it wouldn't matter. It won't affect him very much. Okay, now we just gotta gear the bastard and we're good to go. So, let's give him a weapon. Just so happens the character I picked is good with the sword. So... Sorry about that. Now we've got that, he needs some form of armor. And bye, and we're gonna get him a bulletproof vest. Because everybody needs to be immune to bullets. Kind of. You know those headshots, right? And there we go. Okay. Now we've done that. Okay. So, just for a quick second, I want to make a note that uh, this was our first episode. We got through the entire tutorial without a hitch, right? And everything's still good. So, if you really like this series, let me know down in the comments, smash that like button, and let me know that you're a loyal vassal because I am, of course, the overlord. On the other hand, if you didn't like this video, let us know why. Like, maybe this game just isn't your taste, and if that's, that's the case, that's okay. You don't have to watch. We're not here to force you. Unless you're Kaisis, in which case you have to watch. You're an asshole. I'm just playing. On that note, take care, stay safe, stay well, and I will see you guys all in the next episode of Disgaea. Once again, please support the official release. Later, everybody. Bye. Okay, who else can we pump up a bit? I think the we could get some stuff for like Etna and Laharl.